Am I the asshole? For telling my mom she was wrong to leave me during my labor? I'm a 23 years old female, and I recently gave birth to a baby boy. My relationship with his father wasn't exactly a healthy one, and so it was mutually decided that he wouldn't take a personal role in raising his baby. Instead, I'd raise him with my mom and dad 58f and 60 meters. My parents had never approved of the relationship and certainly didn't like my boyfriend. Despite that, upon learning about my pregnancy they were absolutely amazing and provided me with a lot of support. Naturally I asked my mom if she would be my birthing partner, and she happily accepted. As the months went on however, my mom started becoming distant with me. She was still wonderful and helped me so much with things like setting up a nursery in the spare room, rubbing my back when it ached and providing advice, but something seemed colder about her. Upon asking my dad he told me I was being silly and that mom was fine. One night I came downstairs only to see mom crying on the sofa and clutching one of the soft toys we bought for my baby. She saw me and yelled at me to go upstairs and leave her be. She expressed that she still wanted to be my birthing partner the next day and I perhaps stupidly glossed over it. Soon enough the day came that I went into labor. I was concerned about mom's behavior but I wanted her with me, and she came into the delivery room. Maybe an hour into my labor, my mom said she felt stifled and needed to get some air. She was gone for over an hour and one of the nurses went to try and find her, but couldn't. I rang her and told her she was wrong to have left me, and she screamed at me that my labor was my problem, not hers. I hung up and basically spent the rest of my labor in tears. My dad came as fast as he could from work and was furious at my mom. Some extended family members are now saying that I was cruel to my mom for expecting her to be there for the whole birth, and they agreed with her that I shouldn't expect her to fix my problem. I didn't agree but now I'm feeling guilty. Did I expect too much of my mum? Perhaps reality just smacked her upside the head she just realized that she is 58 her life has been put on hold because she will be helping to raise her child's child. Doesn't excuse her behavior but it may explain it. Have you spoken to her since having the baby? Maybe you should ask her? I understand why you were upset. Your mother agreed to help then walked out on you. That's not okay. I do have some empathy for your mother as well though. She just picked the worst time to lose her shit. Not the asshole. Edit word. Not the asshole but at the same time, it sounds like your mom has a lot of issues she needs to deal with. She's probably sad that your life hasn't turned out the way she hoped that her grandchild isn't going to have a father because of the choices you've made, and maybe also sad and a bit angry or resentful that she's going to spend her golden years raising your baby instead of enjoying her retirement and freedom. She probably didn't want to express these things to you but I'm betting she's feeling them. She screamed at me that my labor was my problem, not hers. TBH she probably wanted to say your baby is your problem, not hers. I'm going with ESH. She made a commitment to you to be your birthing partner and backed out at the worst possible moment. That sucked, and she was wrong for that. But what you're asking of your parents? To raise your child with you, even if they offered. It's way too much. This isn't their responsibility at all. You're letting your own choices turn their entire world and foreseeable future upside down, and that's also wrong. Info is it possible that your mother had a miscarriage or baby die that you weren't aware about? This sounds like a woman griefing and trying to deal with old trauma. ESH your mom is a grown ass woman and she can use her big girl words to tell you what's wrong. She's obviously enough for not doing so. But come the fuck on is it that hard to figure out? You've given your mom an impossible choice. Either she sacrifices her retirement to raise a baby all over again when she thought she was done or she says no and God only knows what happens to you and your son. If you ruin your mom's life because you couldn't be bothered to shoulder the consequences of your decisions you will be the R. Start taking steps now to support yourself and your child. 
So to be clear you made a baby with a person who was unreliable and decided that you and your parents would take over raising this kiddo. Your parents already raised their children yet they are now expected to change their routine to accommodate you and your child. You made an adult decision and your parents are paying for it. So, let me get this straight. You deliberately had a baby with a BF when you knew things weren't great between you guys. Then you let him off the hook for parenting and expected your parents to be parenting your kid. Your parents didn't like him, yet you chose him and now you're upset that your mom isn't dealing with your dumb choices in the most healthy way possible? Why wow, you're the asshole just for that. Instead, I'd raise him with my mom and dad you're the asshole for that alone. Time to grow up. ESH. Your mom should have communicated with you that she couldn't handle being with you for your labor instead of just disappearing in the middle of it, but you're the asshole for expecting your parents to help raise your kid. They basically just finished raising you and were probably looking forward to finally having some peace. You decided to have the kid, so the kid is your responsibility, don't shove it off onto your aging parents. You should look after your own kid. ESH. Yeah. I get that labor is hard and that raising a child is. But at the same time, you are 23, it's not down to your parents to help raise him together, you are an adult. Your son is their grandchild. Maybe she's worrying about the cost, comparenting etc. She didn't do things maturely, but does she want to do having a kid again? You aren't exactly a 14 year old who got caught having sex, be an adult about it all. Info how were you treating her in the delivery room prior to her going for air? Also, how were you treating her prior? Are you working? Is she doing everything for you? Paying for everything? There's more to this story we're not aware of. I think only Op's mum is aware of it as no one seems to have asked her why she did what she did. Op I think you need to sit down have a heart to heart with your mum about her actions as something isn't adding up. Obviously your mom is overwhelmed by what's in store for her. The timing for her breakdown is truly unfortunate for you but you saw signs that things were not good with her and you chose to ignore them. She still should have been there for the birth. You need to figure out how to raise your baby yourself so your mom can have her life back. We love grandkids but we don't necessarily want to give up our retirement years to raise them. Your plan to raise my kid with my mom and dad makes you you're the asshole. Your mom doesn't want to raise your kid. She knows the second half of her life is no longer her own. Grow up. You have no right to foist this responsibility onto your parents and this is obviously stressing your mom out hugely. You can't just replace the man with your parents and expect them to cater to your every need. You are alone. You decided to keep a child with no father and this is what your life will be now. Apply for subsidized housing and food stamps and just get it over with and don't expect anybody to help you because if you act helpless and needy you will get abandoned by the people you are wringing dry of energy and labor. You're the asshole. You are the one who got pregnant and you selfishly made it your parents' problem. You suck up. You're the asshole. Start using condoms before you do this shit again.